So let's continue on with the uh, content-article.php template part. And now let's say we wanted to add in the date uh, to our uh, particular post. So on line two, you can see I have the underscore date. And if I go to my page and I refresh, you can see it is right here. And there's no HTML or anything being applied to it. In fact, it's next to our featured image here. And I think you all know our HTML is a mess, but we're not, I don't, don't worry about that right now. But let's say you did want to do something with that date. So notice what I'm doing here. I'm just enclosing that in PHP and I'm just doing that. All right, so look at that carefully. I just added some new PHP stuff right, right around everything here. I'm good. Okay. So now that I have the date there, right, I could put, you know, just if I wanted to, right, I could put uh, right before here, right, I could put like, I don't know, the, actually we'll make it just now a paragraph, the date, right, right, like that, and then a closing paragraph right there. And now if I save that and I go back here, you'll see it'll be on a new, right, a new in a, in a new paragraph. Whoops in a new paragraph, right? There there it is, right? You got it? All right. So that's the date, right? And let's talk about the tags, right? Because each of these posts has a tag, uh, one or more, uh, two or more tags, right? So if I save this now, and I'll go back through it in a second, and I reload this page, you can see here I now get food and pizza emitted uh, because those are those are tags. In fact, if I click on food, right, it takes me to a page here, like for showing, uh, you know, stuff for, for the tag food, but we haven't coded that yet, right? So there are the, the tags. And what's going on here, if you inspect this particular HTML, right, if you inspect the tags, you notice how there's a div that got placed around it, right? And you see here that there are the two anchor tags. That's what this code is about right here. So before each, before all the tags, it's gonna put a div, and after all the tags, it's gonna put that. And this comes after each one, right? So I could put like a slash, right? And save that and go back. And if I refresh, you'll see here that the tags uh, are getting a slash between them, right? So this is how you can deal with you know, emitting the tags out for a particular post, right? And this is a particular post, right? This is the the uh, the bagel, bagel, bagels one, right? So I should put in here, just for kicks, I should put in here, right? I could put, and you saw me do this before, um, I could put above here, right? I could say H1, oops, H1, and I can put PHP, and then I can put the title, right? The title, and then a closing H1 after that. And if I go back now, right, you're gonna see here, right, the particular uh, title for the, um, for, the, for the post, right? Now remember, this one is for the site, this one is for the post. Here's the date, and there are the tags, and there is the content, right? You got it? So do you see where we're going with this, right? Again, this is in our, temp, our content-article.php. So take a look at the screen. I'll leave it up and uh, get this coded in, and we'll go from there.